Hello guys. Yeah, I'm a little bit. This is a fault of Liberace weather. In the morning there is a sun, afternoon is rainy, and in the evening storm. So that's it. <coughs> Hello guys, and welcome to our new episode. This time it's going to be about everything and much more about Welcome Week and Orientation Week and why it's recommended and helpful to come just in time and enjoy it with us. Long story short, Welcome and Orientation Week. Welcome and Orientation Week is there every year, it lasts for a week and is meant to welcome you there. It's full of events, useful information, tricks and hacks which make your life at TUL really comfy. Useful thing which is necessary to say is the difference between orientation and welcome week. Regarding to the program, they are identical. There are just differences between the times and dates, but most of the program is shared. The main difference between these two is that Orientation week is for the degree students and welcome week is for Erasmus students. But as I said, the program is mostly shared, so you will spend the time together and it's good. It's organized by the International Office of TUL and ESN Liberets. You always receive the schedule of your week by an email, but they are going to be everywhere around the Facebook. So be sure to follow the Facebook of TUL and ESN. Speaking of the schedule, with regards to our experience, please, please I beg you, I will bend the knee because of it. Be everywhere in time. It is really important and I know that some fellas have real lack of any time management sense. I do not want to generalize, but southern nations are expert in this. So please, be everywhere in time. The program is not obligatory, but it's really highly recommended to participate. You can complete all formalities and the important things quickly and comfortably. You meet and become a friend with all Erasmus guys. And you can spend some time with locals who are prepared to make the week before semester informative, entertaining and unforgettable. Oh, it's raining again. I'm going to introduce you the welcome week of 2019 but next years are going to be really similar maybe the same maybe some changes about times or days or trips but the basic is going to be the same so it's just for you to imagine what it's all about okay day number one presentation of ESN and check your check quiz are prepared the presentation is full of basic and useful information about your stay here there is space for questions and answers and possibility for you to buy a check SIM card, ESN cards and trip vouchers. These trips are going to happen during the week but during whole semester also and the number of attendants is limited so be sure to be there. Check your check is a little competition. You will learn there some basic check phrases in the first part and compete with others in the second part. And you can win there are some prizes, I think. I'm sure. Second day, and in my opinion, the most important day, is registration day. In the morning, uh, these registrations took place in the building G. And after that, uh, the presentation of TUL with huge amount of information began. It included many advices and hacks about our university, which is always good to know. After this point of agenda, uh, collective photo shooting, Isaac card photo shooting and lunch, the registration at the faculty started. In this part of program, uh, you will receive a student number, Wi-Fi password, schedules and of course the lunch. So if you arrive to the Czech Republic later because you couldn't manage it, do not worry. Do not worry so much. You can accomplish all the paperwork later, but it's going to be long for you. In this day, you will have all the important persons and paperwork on one place. After all this, time for the ice-breaking game Sneshka game. But please, one student thought 
that uh, we are going to smash ice cubes by our head. It's not going to happen. It's not about breaking, it's just a figure of speech, it's metaphor. Third day is separated into three parts. The first one, city tour. It is tour around the city. Surprisingly, the ESNR will show you and guide you around the city. Second one, kitchen stuff selling. It's taking place in an assembly room and it's going to be about selling kitchen stuff. Surprisingly again. Keep in mind that there is a lot of things to buy, but also there is a lot of students. So, first come, first served. In case you don't buy everything you need, you will have to go to the city to buy it. For example, to Pepco or Tiger or Tescoma. And third one. Welcome party in hot club. And it's like it's party. How to describe it? It's a party. Party. Day number four. This day is promised for a trip to Yeshtat. So be sure to go there. It will be really strange and shame to stay in Liberec without a trip to Yeshtet, so you can go with us. But advice for you guys, it doesn't seem like, but there is cold up there. Some time ago two Indian guys went to Yeshtet in sandals and it's not a good idea. Take sports shoes and warm clothes, for example some jackets and hats. If there is a rain, there is a plan B. Trip to zoo or trip to Liberecka Vyšina, it's around the corner. It's really near. After these trips, there is a ESN quiz in one of assembly rooms. There are some questions about the Czech Republic and some questions about other countries. So you will find out many interesting facts there. Day number six has two parts. The first one, ice skating. Yeah, like the skating on the ice. It's really enjoyable. And part two, barbecue evening. In front of the hot club, there is a grill master who is going to prepare you some tasty dishes. For example, chicken, pork, beef, corns, cheese, potatoes. The offer is white. And the last day, sport day. We didn't have it this year because of bad weather, but it's all about playing football, volleyball or basketball on the hearts of playground. Okay, and that's all. That's all about the Welcome Week 2019. So, if I forget something, I will summarize it in our web. Be sure to follow TUL Facebook and ESN Liberates Facebook. Enjoy Liberates and Carpet TUL. This is ESN office and it looks a little bit like some uh, atelier. Is it in English? Yes, art atelier. Maybe they should uh, rename it to ESN atelier. <laughs>